What's up guys, it's your boy Alex. I'm going to show you how to solo to wave 50 or stage 50 in the new Halloween event mode, guys. Now I'm going to show you the weapons I used and some weapons you can maybe try if you don't have these exact weapons. Now I spent about 40k gems to get these weapons, so I know it's going to be a little bit difficult for you guys to get it. So uh, if you can't get it, don't worry. Honestly, it's not that hard to do, but like the hardest part is going to be like beating stage 50 to get the mysterious key. Now I actually already have some mysterious keys. You can see I have three mysterious keys here. Um, however, uh, you know, I, that's from the glitch, guys, in the Glitch of Simpson patch. So this is my current roster, guys. Now, you don't need this high of weapons. Honestly, you probably could rock with, like, level 40 on each of these. So I have the Ultra Epic Dagger, the Ultra Epic Fan, and the, uh, another Ultra Epic Fan. Now, my Dagger is 58, my Fan is 54, and my other Fan is 46. So I have a ways to go to max everything out. And now, if you guys want to be able to beat stage 50, like, clear it and get the mysterious key, I think you're going to need this exact loadout, but everything max. And that should get you close. But the thing is, that's going to literally take you, like, so long because you have to do the orb farming portion. So I'm hoping to be able to get this dagger up to legendary, and I'm hoping that's good enough. So let's go run it, guys, and I'll show you how far I can get. Hey, guys, this event is crazy. Now, they maybe change the event tomorrow or Sunday, so I would hold off on spending any gems on the weapons. Before we know what the new changes are, Fruity did confirm in a Discord message an announcement that he is going to change some things, so uh, watch out for that, guys. I don't want you guys to get, um, you know, scammed out of gems that you don't need to. f has mentioned that they might be, like, buffing the damage or, like, making it easier to get candies. So, again, guys, if your goal is to get candies and not the mysterious key, don't do this. However, if you want to get candies and you soloing to wave 50 is pretty easy. Like what I'm doing now, but beating it is gonna be hard. But this is a great way to get candy, guys. You can get like 700 candies per round. Honestly, I you can get about one Nightmare Luffy per day if you kind of just like hat semi AFK grind it. You just literally, I just usually like place my units, leave or watch a YouTube video and come back. Or at work, I would just like play on my phone. I would just like run it on my phone, and as soon as I saw it, I it was time to do a new game. I would just play it. So I basically been grinding this event like no lifing it, and that. In the at night, I go in the gem chamber because you know your boy's broke on gems. I can only afford like four more chests, so like that's a twenty percent odds to get an epic, and then I need to get the epic I need, so that's like one in seven odds. So like three percent odds to get a dagger, so it's not that great. Or yeah, but the dagger might set me over the edge, but I'll show you guys how close I am to beating stage fifty. But I'm gonna easily get to stage fifty. So I'm like literally like inches away, but that last inch is gonna take me a mile. It's crazy, man. This this event went crazy. If they just, like, lower the boss's health by a tiny bit, like, the scaling, make the scaling not as crazy. Because right now, each boss has double the health as the next boss, so, like, right about. So, uh, if they just make that a tiny bit easier, like, maybe instead of double, make it, like, 80% or 90%, like, your boy Aloe would easily solo this, man, and get all the mysterious keys. But, I mean, I do have three mysterious keys, so I really can't be too mad. Thanks to the glitch. I'm glad they didn't remove them from us. That would be pretty sad. Looking at the damage, guys, we pretty much two shot everything. Let's take a look here. Eight, one. Okay, that was like a one perfect one shot or whatever. Sick. Look at that. Uh, it depends on how the depends on how we hit the enemy. Sometimes two hit at a time. Sometimes they all three do. This is actually right around stage twenty, guys. You saw stage ten like came and went. That's the nice thing about when you have high level weapons. The stages go by so fast, so it's actually even faster to AFK it. Like, look at this, guys. This guy got melted, guys. It's going to take us, like, 20 seconds. To... It literally took us, like, li exactly 20 -ish seconds. Like, 21 seconds to beat this boss. Like, if you extrapolate that, that means it's going to take us, what, 42 to beat the 30 boss? And then 80-something to beat the next box? So, like, we're so close, man. It's You can taste it, but... Hopefully, I'll be able to finish that out for you guys maybe tomorrow... It just depends, though, because I'm going to need an orb farm, like, so much, man. I'm going to need a no-life that orb farm, dude. It's going to be terrible. That's the one thing I hate. Oh, my gosh. Plus, like, doing all... Plus, I'm at the point where I can't... I have to wait... I have to do, like, two rounds. Actually, three rounds to be able to upgrade a weapon twice. So, it's getting pretty expensive to upgrade these weapons, man. Oh, my gosh, guys. Now, it wouldn't be a problem at all, but, again, those freaking orb requirements, man. Oh, my gosh. They're impossible, dude. Like... I know I've grinded orb farm a long time ago, and I just burned all my materials. Like, dang, dude. Also, guys, if you're wondering what the best weapons are, dagger, fan, and staff. So if you're not using the d dagger, fan, and staff, I recommend, like, quit. Personally, I like the dagger and fans. Um, 
Now, I do. Re I don't know, man. If you if you have a legendary fan, try to get the dagger and the staff as well in Ultra Epic, because it's nice. Because if you split up the weapons, you don't have to farm as many materials. So that's the problem with me using two fans. Is now I need to order farm twice as much to get these last few levels, which is kind of gonna suck. So we'll see. I'm hoping to pull off and get that legendary uh, dagger. If I can get that legendary dagger, man. Yo, maybe we'll clap the stage 50, but I don't know, man. If it's a 30% damage boost, that might be enough to get me over the edge, but I got no idea. It's crazy, man. How long have I been grinding this event, dude? I think I took this event seriously starting on, like, Tuesday, and it's Friday. We've been grinding this for, like, four days right about straight. So, like, every day we get to, like, another 10, but this, this stage 50 has been taking a minute. Dang. And you guys know we've been grinding ore farm on stream, guys. So make sure you turn into the stream. We do this sometimes. We do ore farm as well. Oh, good. 304. That means we should be able to get a, another upgrade on our dagger. How much is our dagger doing? Oh, man. Let's see here. It's doing 610, maybe? Or 511? Yeah, I mean, it's a good, it's a good weapon. But, I mean, yeah, these runs don't take that long, to be honest. Um, they'd probably take, like, we'll do the timer on it. We should be able to finish this video in, like, 10 -ish minutes. I don't know. But, yeah. As far as getting shards go, I'm trying to figure out if the highways give you more shards or not. But from my experience, it seems like they give you about the... Wait, we're getting seven shards twice. We got two times, we got seven shards in a row. Let's see if we get another seven shards in a row. And then we can kind of know... Okay, we got two shards. So I think it's just random. I only think... I think you just get farther, so maybe it's not that advantageous to go on these higher waves. I don't know. But the candy's really good, though. And remember, guys, if you're running this in quads, you're gonna get four. You're gonna get one fourth of the candies. The candies split evenly between the players, which is stupid because the bosses have like all that health. So I don't really understand it. But uh, yeah, I, unfortunately, you can't really run this or running this in duos or quads doesn't even help. And honestly, there's kind of no point. The only time it would help if you're trying to get your friend more crystals, maybe. But even then, like, what the heck? That's, that's probably my biggest pet peeve about the event. You can't work together. They should make it the scaling, not linear. If it's uh, if you're with somebody, like, they should make it, um, uh, like, instead of double, double scaling, it should be, like, 75% scaling. And then people would actually work together. Because as it stands right now, if you're working together, you're literally not going to get Nightmare Loopy. Like, I was grinding this on stream. I was getting, like, 1 to 200 candies for, like... 50 like stage 50 solo i mean per stage 50 with the quad but like when i run at austrium i get like seven or eight hundred candies per which basically got me a nightmare loopy in one day guys so like if you extrapolate that out guys you can get like by the time the event's over in like two weeks you can be able to get like 10 probably at least 10 nightmare loopies guys before the event's over so a lot of people are asking about like why i think nightmare loopies value is so low or going to go low it's for that exact reason, guys. Um, there's literally no point because, like, you can get, like, ten of them so easily. I already have enough for two. I'm going to say because it says there's more prizes in the shop, and I kind of want to know what they are. Because if they're, like, gems or something, like, I don't really need a second Nightmare Luffy that much. But, like, your boy kind of strapped for gems, so maybe I'll go for that. Or if I can get weapons, I would gladly take that. Because if I can get that Legendary Dagger, man, sheesh, I'm hoping that gets us all the way to uh, the stage we need to get. Or maybe a legendary fan, but I don't, I don't think it's going to help. Like, if you see how... Look, we beat this guy with uh, 42 seconds, guys. That means we are actually 28 seconds short of being able to beat the final boss. Dang, dude, that's tough. That's tough, man. That's tough. That last 28 seconds, guys, is going to take us... Sheesh, probably another week or so. Dang, man. Dang, dude. Yo, Fruit, man. He needs to give us another way to get weapons, yo. How about every 10 ways we get a common weapon or a, or a chance at an uncommon? We should get a common or uncommon. That would make this so much better. That way people can get mythics, man. Honestly, I don't even know if anybody in the game has a mythic right now because I'm not going to lie, that literally is going to cost you, like, five over, like... Bro, I don't even want to talk about how much money that would cost, dude. Oh my gosh, man. Bro, we're talking like over a thousand dollars worth. That's like a thousand dollar item. Like, oh my goodness. Like, dang, dude. How many gems? You can't even get gem that many gems without money. So, like, if anybody has mythics, they're literally pay to win because it's physically impossible for them to have a mythic if they're not pay to win. Like, what the heck? Like, literally, man. 
So that, that's kind of the reason I'm a little bit mad at this event. But like, overall, it's a good idea for an event. I like it. Kind of like a little bit anime fighter style, like a little more simulator style, a little more chill. It's kind of nice because it gives us an alternative to being in the AFK chamber. And uh, I guess it gives us a cool unit. And now the one, I guess the best thing about it is it does allow you to get EXP units kind of fast on AFK. Because you get an EXP 6 star every like 10-ish minutes. Every about 10 minutes you get an EXP 6 star. Which is definitely faster than pretty much anything else. That is kind of nice. Because that be, that's the equivalent of getting to stage 20, so it's pretty close. On like uh, infinite mode extreme. All right, let's see where we're at here, guys. Wait, stage 49. All right, let's see, guys, if we can clutch it. I'm going to click all the things. If I see a rainbow, I'm going to click it. Because we got to see there you go, guys. Stage 50. If I see a rainbow, I'm going to click it. And I need, to get the, I need to go get the screenshot, though. I haven't seen any rainbow things to click yet, man. Bro, we're trying to beat this boss. There's literally no rainbows to click. Yo, what the heck, man? Yo, there we go. We'll click it. We'll click it. I honestly think the rainbows hurt, dude. Like, low-key. I was looking at how much damage they do. I don't think they help. I don't know, though. All right, we're at 94 seconds. So we have to be able to get to the middle when it says 70 and you're honestly, we're pretty close. Like, look how, bro, like, we're literally, like, you can taste it, man. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. Oh, yeah, click that, click that, get that ultimate. Like, look how close we are, guys. Like, dude, it's gonna be so close, man. Can we clutch this out, guys? Can we clutch it, man? Yo, we're like, oh my gosh, we're so close, dude. We hit the middle at. Count it. 62 seconds, guys. 62 seconds. That means it took us 78. That means we're like 16 seconds off, dude. Oh my gosh, man. That's crazy, dude. 16 seconds off, man. Bro, if every level was one second, yo, we'd get it easy, but I don't think it's like that. I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it is. Yo, 42 seconds left, guys. Can we get it, dude? Can we get it, man? 36. Ooh, it's... I don't know, dude. I don't, I don't see enough of the rainbow thingies. I don't even think the rainbow thingies help. Like, I swear, bro. Tell me in the chat... Tell me in the comments, man. Let me know if the rainbow things actually help, yo. I swear they don't, dude. Yeah, I swear they do nothing, man. Yo, 18 seconds. Can we get to this little thingy, maybe? Dude, like, this is ridiculous, man. We get another screenshot. Six, five, four, three, two, one. This is how close we are, guys. This is how close we are to beating stage 50, man. Like, I can, you can literally taste it, dude. Oh, my gosh. Well, there you go, guys. That's how you sold it to stage 50. Hope you guys enjoyed. And we're about, like, I'll show, you, I'll show you my candies, too, actually. We have crazy amount of candies from this method, man. I think it's on average 700 candies per round. Dang, dude. Just dang, man. That, that's a lot of candies, man. That's a lot of candies, dude. That's all I'm gonna say. A ton of candies there. All right, let's go show you guys how much candies I have, guys. 36K, dude. I can get tons of these guys. I can even get another Nightmare Luffy, man. Easy dubs. All right, guys, have a great night. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Blanspot out. Peace.